I swear, I, you know, I want to do the little, okay, where am I, what, 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 hello, welcome, but also, you two, why do you lie to me when I try to turn things down, I try to turn things down, and it goes, okay, yeah, it's quiet now, and then it's still, like, as loud as it was a second ago, don't you lie to me, buddy. I feel stupid that I didn't do this beforehand. And then you link elsewhere. There Constantly forget that on Discord of all places, I have to do the little HTTPS. I feel like most places you can just do like Twitch.tv and then that's it and it counts. But not Discord. Confuses me every day. God damn. <laughs> I'm gonna make uh, this note. I am opening the game and setting it up in the background so if you can hear that, I apologize. Uh, I pushed back because after going out and suffering through driving to get my dinner, I 
I don't full screen it if I'm turning you lower. That's like a given, dude. Yeah, I guess so. But I'm just messing with it real quick. It should hopefully not take too long. There we go, it's already set up. Security breach, please be quiet for like... For like five seconds. I don't need ominous background music! <laughs> to my Nintendogs plus cats and music. Why? There. So I got that fixed up. We got that going. Oh my gosh. Okay, wonderful. I trying to not full screen the game. It wanted to break everything that is full screen. Oh, fuck, did it break me? No, it didn't. It. Piano Tube wants to think I'm broken, but I'm not. Okay, fine, if you want to be the background music so bad, you can be. Literally, all I had to do to fix it up was uh, change the resolution and call it a day, and I need to turn down the volume a little bit. Yeah, about down to there is good. I'm hoping down to there is good. I'm already turning the master volume down a lot lower than it should be. No, the jump scare volume is going down too. I don't need that. I don't need that in my life. I was going over it. I was gonna head on over it already, anyways. Uh, here's a downside. Security Breach doesn't have cloud saves. I'm sure if I really wanted to, I could manually move files over from my laptop to keep my Security Breach saves of, like, you know, the multiple times I beat this game. And I could just explore at, like, 6am or something. But, no! It doesn't like me. And I'm too lazy to do that, so... I guess it's also an excuse for me, because now I can go into areas of the right times. To A, test my knowledge of how well to get around everywhere, and B, just... Yeah. Test if half of my favorite glitches still work, or if they got patched in the year it's been since I've played. I did play a little bit beforehand. However, the little bit I played was just getting to the daycare. It didn't take long. There's there's a big gap between these two, but that's because this was when Toontown went down on, I think, Sunday. And then this was starting it back up. Because I remembered what I got stuck on at one point. It's just because I forgot the whole point was sneak behind Chica after you distract her. Instead of... Just run as fast as you fucking can. But no, so I got to the daycare at least. It was very fast getting here. The only jump scare I got in the process was uh, proceeding to forget the sneaking behind Chica thing. Which, you know, at least isn't too much of an issue. Yeah, I'm a little bit too high on her. Oh no. I'm fixing that a little bit. Uh, for today, I just sit a bit, a little bit lower. 
Please remind me to like control Z that. Ever. Okay, here's an issue. I knew this was gonna be an issue, probably. Is the one thing this game may not like, and I can't blame it for not liking it for once. Is that always different colors? Holy shit, that's cool. Is uh, I have the graphics on Ultra because I was testing how well it can go. And I've played on Ultra and it doesn't lag. But it will now probably because it's also trying to handle streaming it. But at the same time, at least it fucking renders the bathrooms the second I look at them. I can at least give the game the benefit of the doubt and that I never knew that was there. So in at least that form I can give the game the benefit of the doubt. Cause I mean fuck. What are the What are their like recommended fucking My son never had sleeping problems, but after spending an evening in the daycare, he refuses to sleep with the lights out anymore. He just cries and cries, and then when I do let him keep the lights on, he wets the bed. Oh, buddy. And like, what are their recommended ones? Like, recommended specs for it. Because I know this much. I know that I wanted to trust this game to run at least a bit better on this computer. Because I actually changed both my CPU and my GPU to match the recommended ones for the quarry. Thank you, Hunter, for that. Yeah, let me look into that. Because I know there's, like, system requirements minimum or recommended, and they'll recommend those. Like, I actually upgraded from a Ryzen 5 to a Ryzen 7 because of the recommended ones for the quarry, and is what helped me pick out my graphics card, actually. I am reminded I still need to update my panel so I have a specs one. Oh no, I'll look up Security Breach real quick. What are your recommended specs, buddy? It's an amazing show to me when they don't have a recommended graphics. And the minimum graphics that they say is required is one that I know my laptop had and it ran horribly on my laptop. Because I know I had the same processor on my laptop, I had about that much RAM on my laptop. My graphics card was a little bit better than that one. Which, also, that's your nice, fun show of how bad it was. Oh, well, bark, bark, hello! I'm looking- I am paused for a second because I decided to be questioning if I meet the- if I meet, like, their recommended graphics for this. Well, recommended specs. And I am off-put by the fact that, yes, I got a little string bean, this little TTS one. I am off-put, though, by the fact that they're, uh, so yeah, required there's a graphics card suggestion. However, in the, uh, in the recommended section, there is no graphics recommendation at all. That's weird. It's a little weird. I've been staring everywhere in this game though because I have it- I have the graphics a little bit too high, I'm guessing, because you don't need to play on Ultra. I just wanted to test if this could run on Ultra, and it does. Just a little bit better off stream. But it's made me like look at little details and appreciate them more. Like noticing that Sun and Ergo Moon both have a little hook in their back. So then, 
moon can have a hook to go from the ceiling, which is pretty cool. <laughs> I find it funny that it's in the statue. Yeah, I might need to turn down my graphics a little bit. Because it runs just fine in personal play, it's just... I forgot there's that difference when you start streaming it. Yeah, so we might have to mess with that a little bit. That's audio, I'm stupid. Video, yeah, we might have to turn down, uh, something. <laughs> yeah, yeah, one of these is gonna have to go. Not all of these should be at this for streaming. But in my defense, it looks good. Oh my god, the lights have a flicker to them. If you want low quality, go back to my old security breach streams. I think I have those archived. All I know it's this much. Uh, the loads in the ball pit. Balls. Yeah. This is what I'm upset about. This, uh, this was... Maybe I'm either doing it wrong or they patched it, but... In the first patch release, like the one where you could skip cutscenes, including... Uh, the one over there. From sun to moon. The way that you do daycare percent with clips, all those skips, is originally in the first version you would just hop back up into the slide, because you could be able to do that then. You'd climb up a little bit, you'd be able to glitch out of bounds and run off that way. It's just a skip both cutscene of sun coming down and sun picking you up and sun existing in general in the area to stop you. You'd skip all of that so you could go back to the back and then do the flashlight skip. Also don't know if that works anymore so we're gonna have fun testing that. But then in the next one, the update where I started speedrunning it and I accidentally did skip skipped one the way then was to like run here jump as much as you can and then it'd clip you up here you'd run along, jump onto that side, and just go so far it looks like I can't do that anymore because it bounces me away and it's stupid I am of the personal belief the clips you should fix in your game are ones that anybody can accidentally come across. Not the speedrun strats that people like to practice to do. So speaking of the speedrun stuff that I just went off on for a bit too long... First, I'm gonna come over here because there's a flashlight upgrade here. Okay, so you let me up here. But anywhere else, I can't go. My god, you people went fucking wild with the invisible walls and any upgrade to this. I in no way have any, like, ill thoughts towards a steel wall. Because what you do, you try to get over here, get to this one, because it has an invisible wall at some point in these. You see be able to not mix up your sprint and your crouch. Jump over there. No, no, no. I just got so bad that I my last time I just couldn't speed run it. I just stop trying. At least one of the best if I remember the strats. Just in the way of 
how to easily get all the generators. One here. Go this way. Down this one. Right here, there's the second. Drop down out of here. Run back in here. Get that one, that's three. There's another one in here. I feel stupid, but I don't remember another one in here. And you risk it all. Drop out this one. I hate you. No, no! Oh, drop out of that one. Go in here. Pick that one that's four. The only one in this whole structure. You run across, risk your life for way too long to get into this one. And then that one. But I swear I remember there being one there. I could be wrong. Usually the way some people do it, I think. I've seen some people go down the slide after. I don't understand going down the slide after. I don't really understand going down the slide after now. Where the fuck did you come from, actually? Please. Please drop me. Please remember to drop me. Son, I don't know how long I can do this, bud. Son. Buddy. Buddy! He's like staring at me for a good minute and then finally takes a step forward and he stares at me and takes a step forward and then he stares at me and takes a step forward. We can't be breaking it already, dude. I'm finding all of these and tipping them over now. Be nice to the puppy. So I'm just stuck because I don't remember if it's five generators or it feels like it used to be six. Of them. This, this area is off limits. You're gonna get us in trouble. Don't you want a puppet show? Oh, no, no, no! What a mess! Oh, it's was the bottom. Where is the top? Clean that, clean that. You can just do flashlight. You can still do flashlight skip. You can still do the fucking flashlight skip. Jump on this. Jump on this chair. Jump across to here. Jump on. Make it replicable, apparently, because I'm done. Get up here. You can't get on that desk, so you just get on the chair. I remember the one issue being that it's like. Sprint feels inconsistent half the time when you're trying to do it on jumps. You're gonna stare at me, I'm doing speedrun strats. There we go. Yeah, you can still do flashlight skip. They didn't patch that one. I mean, I can understand why they didn't patch it. That's like... The last thing I would expect somebody to casually find out you can do. Yes, here is the dog stance of the day. I do not understand patching games to entirely get rid of specifically speedrun strats compared to this game is actually glitched. Does it feel bad to say the only example I have in my brain is like a hello neighbor? Like, he had to be really dedicated to do the skips, and they still patch them anyways. I heard the whirring and I moved the way that my mouse wasn't. I thought he picked me up somehow. I'm just trying to make sure I can do this consistently before I try to do anything else. There we go. Thank Listen, if the strat is just Minecraft parkour, I should be allowed to do it. In theory, you could do a more simpler one like that, I think. Could be wrong. Like, up on this desk. Can you see this? How did I do it already? Oh no. Oh no, I can't replicate it. Oh wait, no, it was the monitor. 
have to monitor the uh, tower. Get across to here. In the box. Get across to here. Mm, I see why. Also because you start with having to take the security badge. Basically the whole reason for this, for that one, is if you don't grab the flashlight beforehand, it will not let you walk out this way. It puts up like an actual- well, A, there's a barrier here, and there's also a barrier here, like an invisible wall after you take the badge, and it stays until sun transforms into moon. So you can use it to get a head start and already start heading up that slide to hit your first generator. Alright, let's test. Fuck. Fuck. Nope. Okay. You know what? I saved back there. I feel- I- I have faith in myself to just constantly quit and restart when I fuck it up. I'm like, don't worry, I'm gonna practice consistently I doing that. This, this area is off limits! You're gonna get us in trouble! Fuck, I don't fuck. you want a puppet show? Yep. I am glitter glue! Do you like glitter glue? Oh. This is just how video game be. And I got a new friend! This this area is off limits! You're gonna get us in trouble! I wanna bet it's the suddenly realizing I'm on a time limit that makes me fumble the fucking bag. I wanna bet that's what it is. I want to bet that that's what it is. The second that I realize there's a time limit, I fumble the bag and scare myself into not being able to. <laughs> but also, I'm proving that I suck at the consistency too. Like, I missed this multiple times. I just bounced myself off of it that time. fails. I have never actually done flashlights. How the fuck did you get over here? Oh god, we're- no we aren't even- I forgot that he just fucking spins around for some reason at that point. No, no! What a mess! Oh, which was the bottom? Where is Wes, the I said you were on the Absolutely right! What the not. fuck? I'm not that right. Approaching it right. Yeah, I can do that, I think. Because even if you do take the flashlight, it still stops you from going across. Most people just do it because taking the flashlight is a time loss. Oh, see, I can just use that to hop over. No matter what, even if I have the flashlight. People just also have the uh, gamma as high as I do. They can see during the dark. I just have it this high because my eyes hate me. I have faith in myself. Let's go this time. I pressed E again and it still didn't count it. Oh god damn. You know what? Okay. I don't have faith. Yeah, see there's a visible wall here. Oh, no! I have to see this whole cutscene. Gregory, I do not know what you did, but the lights are out in the daycare. You need to find the emergency backup generators and turn them on. 
there's only five. I know where they all are now. The only downside is then you have to fucking book it this way. And hope and pray you make it over there. And bang. There's all of the generators and the fastest way to reach all of them. Just without flashlight skip because I can't pull it off in the moment apparently. I am still scared of that section even though even though I've done it so many times and I've proven each and every time that I can get through there without dying to moon. Still scared out of my mind. Alright, time to get kicked out. Rule breaker, rule breaker! You are banned from the dead town! Gregory, jump in. We need to get out of here now. They have you found ever, you. like, fake? <laughs> Chico, are you fucking good? Oh my god! While we are together. We are almost out of time. We need to get to a recharge station at speed. Every hour the power is diverted to the recharge stations. When that happens, the lights go out. And when right. that happens, oh. the daycare attendant is free to roam the building. It will find you. It paused me there for a second. <laughs> uh, scared for a second, amazing. That is a fountain. A fountain is a decorative reservoir used for discharging water. Not the fountain. You didn't see the dancing rabbit lady right in front of us? No, I did not. There is no rabbit at the Mega Pizza Plex. Not anymore. This is crazy. It's like the whole place is trying to get me. I am not. Why? I do not know. I want to help you. Maybe they want to help you, too. I doubt it. For some reason, you're different. Okay, here's a random... Good thing. news. The front doors will open in five hours. Good news? Five hours? I'm not gonna last I five say minutes! This, this Do window. not panic. If we get separated again, you can always call me on your fast watch. As long as I have power. And I am able to reach you. I... I hate to say my one little questiony thing is... Why did they do that? Why did the captions do that? It's like literally one word that could also fit across the bottom of the screen. But it's saved for the next set of captions. The next set of captions being... One word. I'm so confused. I promise I don't want to seem like nitpicky of everything, but it kind of, it just bugs me a little bit. Why? I like floor bots. Yep, we don't glitch as bad as I used to. The first time I ever played this game, I had it in like a big clip compilation. That never took off on TikTok. <laughs> uh... It only did when I took the one clip of me yelling at sun. But one of my main ways I broke this game before was I'd look in here and my laptop was so bad it would not load in this area. So I just fell back down to like the starting stage. We should get okay. moving. You can access the main atrium with your new security badge. I do not care if I can access there. 
I need to walk out this way because this is so pretty to me to look at this. All right, Freddy, drop me. I got a screenshot of this before for my own time, but just... It just looks so nice! Except for that unloaded texture! There we go! No, it's not unloaded, it's just at that distance it doesn't want to load in right. It just looks so nice! I promise, this is my nice thing. I absolutely adore this game. I do just get a little nitpicky about some things. I also get confused by by the hour these guys get so disgusting. It does. I really like the way that I have it set up, because I have it with the gamma really high, because I get really bad eye strain. With if I and with horror games, of course, they all have really dark settings, and you know I have to strain my eyes to see anything. So I like that I can change, like change the lighting and all of that, so I can actually hi buddy, so I can actually see. And so I can play for longer, because I'm not straining my eyes to see for longer. I still don't get how you get this disgusting in one hour. Do they just, like, repaint you and wash you up every morning? Actually, I would not put it against the uh, Freddy Fazbear chain to do that. But no, I like... I like when I set the gamma this high, because then it makes it look like what I imagined it would look like during the day. And it just looks so much nicer, and it makes me wish- In a weird way, I know the point of all of the FNAF games is to tell you you shouldn't do this. But it makes me want a real-life pizza plex so bad. Because, if you know, if there weren't, like, killer animatronics or... Anything in the basement to worry about or anything, this would be, like, a really fucking cool place. What sucks, though, is, like, also... These are the things I can say about a uh, Security Breach. I absolutely adore this game, but I also... Same. But I also adore... Nice so sadly... Like, I'll remember the things of older trailers of what was possible. I feel like that's so cool. I wish it still could do that, though. I remember in one of the trailers, this elevator was functional. I have identified two possible exit points. The main loading dock is located under the food loading court on the first floor. There is also a fire escape in the third floor prize counter. Check your fast watch. I will mark both locations on your fast map. It appears that you have no fast map. You should be able to obtain one from the greeter on the center balcony. I hate the greeter on the center balcony. Did we just- Oh yeah, this is actually what I wanted to test. This is actually what I wanted to test, the uh, main atrium. I wanted to see if suddenly everything runs worse in here because the main atrium is such a big area compared to everywhere else to load in. Hi, please take this map. Take a map. Thank you. Please enjoy. Free map. Can you get out here? Why are you over there? You know what? I'm not gonna question it. No, this is one thing I like. That it's a, a little harder to notice now that he is extra grimy from God knows- Is your paint chipping? Did they just- I- I can't question if they use cheap stuff on you that fits the brand. It was one of my favorite notes that I noticed is like, even in the beginning of the game, he has like at least a little chips away at where metal definitely meets metal constantly. Like... Stop staring at me, it makes it harder. Like, uh, I'll shine the flashlight at it and then stop. Like, his- Fuck, what's that? What's that part of your arm? Like, his bicep, right around where the shoulder pads are, 
There's some chipping there because that definitely moves a lot. Around his whole stomach hatch, there's a lot. I don't understand the one near his eye, but he's got one near his eye too. That was like a little touch that I like, even in his not grimy one. That, of course, the parts that move a ton and are metal on metal have a lot of paint chipping on them. Alright, let's see. Oh my god, I can read the map. Holy fucking shit, this is new to me. Alright, Freddy, we're gonna see if I can break the game again. I'm not going in the vent. It wasn't this one. Hang on. It's this one up here. It's, yeah. Tell me who was casually doing this for me to not be allowed to. Tell me who! remember one of my favorite yeah they went fucking wild with the invisible walls when they patched this game don't they damn but also maybe it proves that they need to when I say my favorite thing to do is on that Roxy trash can you just kind of jump up and get past there run around the back you jump hard enough at one of these you can still get over and then repeat the process over there. And then when Fred Door was still a thing, you could use it all the way over there to get into the Roxy Raceway bit. Climb stuff to get over to Phaser Blast. And then you could get the Vanny ending that way. That's just if you follow everything as you're supposed to up to this point. That's why it's not a speed a speed run strat. Because who is spending that much time for that? Oh my god, the Monty Pinata! I forgot! He looks so stupid, too! I love him! I don't know if it does this at any resolution. My absolute favorite thing I've been noticing is that the floor actually looks like a tile floor and reflects all of the lights. I don't know if it did this at, like, the lower ones. Because I swear I don't remember anything reflecting off the ground. Or if it did, it was a horrible, horrible resolution to the point I didn't notice on my laptop. I must look at my inventory now to stare at him. There he is! <laughs> I love him so much, he looks so stupid! My favorite thing is that he doesn't have eyes under these, he just has the really tiny sunglasses. <laughs> I love him so much. And everything else is just kind of normal. I like looking at these because I really like the artwork in these too. What do I have to accept? Accept my fate? <laughs> oh no, here's uh, one thing I remember. I'm so upset that the first thing they ever patched was Fredor. It looks like you do not have security clearance. Where the fuck are you to say this? Find the open vent near the salad bar to bypass security. Don't add voice lines chewing people out for doing Fred Door. Did they see- I'm- I'm sorry. Did they seriously fucking patch the game at some point to add a voice line to chew people out for glitching through this area to avoid the vent part? Did they seriously fucking do that? Oh my god! I think that's like 
one good patch of that. I was about to complain about them taking away Fred Door, so they add a voice line to chew out people that used to do Fred Door. That's new. <laughs> when they patched it out, there wasn't a voice line there. That's the first time I've ever heard that. Oh my god. <laughs> No, you could, uh... I'd be like, Freddy, come here. And then, you'd like, get in him. And then... Freddy used to push you through the invisible walls so you could just go through. You know what? New test, new test, new test. Uh, Freddy, stand right here. Thank you. Cause then, like, he opens this. You don't have the security way, but you could use him to push you through. To go to that elevator, get down, You'd avoid the whole vent section, the whole having a sneak past Chica section. You just go up, grab the security badge. Freddy's already down here. You could still do the pizza thing. You just grab Freddy after, take him back to the elevator. And then... I don't think there's a way around the arcade one, so you'd have to do the arcade legit. Then you'd get both security badges? And I used to do it all of the time, just because it meant you got security clearance to go see Freddy when he got taken to repairs. Just because I fucking hate the endoskeleton part. I'm not trashing on the game, I just hate doing it. It's like one of the most stressful parts is just. Oh god, okay. Freddy, can you walk me over there? You can't let me in. I want Fred Door back! <laughs> I don't want Fred. I don't want the addition of a. I- I like the vent section a lot more. This one, for some reason, seems a lot easier to fucking do than the, uh, arcade one. But that's also just because half the time, I don't know where Roxy is in there. And there's way too many staff bots to just book it half the time. Then again, I've done it by just booking it before. I love this game so much and remember so many parts of it, but also a lot of them are strung together weird because I always liked messing with the order of stuff. And again, at the same time, I feel like it's a given that I probably like messing with stuff because I think it was a little after this time last year was when I streamed just... <laughs> Your little earring have physics, I love that. And I think it was a little later than- I think it was around this time last year that I s that I just did a nice little challenge to myself of getting all of the achievements. Though I know way too much sequence breaking off the top of my head. <laughs> Cause you be safe! Does little Roblox wave. Okay, little music man, where are ya?
You totally don't terrify me. Yeah, I would probably actually rather do the uh, arcade than this. I forgot about fucking Mini Music Man. And his stress-inducing little... Never mind, that wasn't as long as I remembered it being. Okay, you're telling me that straight of a drop. I don't break my legs. Great job! He's just painted on the wall. Oh god! <laughs> okay, I can't break the game and see what's breaking ways, but I can do this. Drum roll, please. I can't break it in meaningful ways, but I can do that. <laughs> Different maze ever. Oh, fuck, I have to do maze or size. God damn it. Can I do it on these? Are they too close together so it doesn't do it? Damn it. Just needs this much of a gap. Forgot. I used, I like heavily modded it in the past, but like in fun ways. I want my no Mazer size mod back. All it did was get rid of every single fucking wall in Mazer size. And this is the Freddy Fizzy Faz here. This is an achievement for getting all of them that are Fizzy Fazes. Half of them, though, at least an A. You should have been opening every box as you saw them type shit. Hi, buddy. I don't get the point of camera. Okay. Oh fuck, wait, I forgot like my actual least favorite part of this. Frank, Frank, stop, stop, stop. bit after this. You sneak past her with the pizza. God damn it. I kept forgetting there's parts I loathe about all of it. Isn't it fun? I love this game, but I hate the parts you have to do. What was that? Ah! Thank you. <laughs> I got a notification on my phone and the fucking throw noise scared me. God damn it. Okay, goodbye. I am no longer here. I can still have fear put it into me. I admit it constantly. I am just a wuss that is scared of horror games at the end of the day. doesn't help that the tense music obviously adds to it. Fuck. Well, it's too late to back out now because I saved over my last save. I'm sorry, that far away and you're telling me it's shaking the room like she's in here? Just leave. Okay. 
That one, that's the furthest way out. She's just walking back and forth down there. Oh, so just busted that down. Okay, it's fine. I was about to say, and then watch her be like perfectly in front of that one right, right as I do that shit. I am too much of a wuss for my own good. I am too much of a wuss. Oh, where's the door I'm at? Can you go that way? Thank you. I'm just gonna make a straight shot and run for it. If I die, I die. If I die, I don't die. Oh, hello. Wonder <laughs> God damn it! Don't worry, I'll just loop around! There she is again. Yeah, I kinda- I kinda fucked up by saving here. Me and my damn habit of just save over the last save. I don't like that I can hide here. I've, I've always thought that, and I didn't say it right now. I've always hated that you can hide there. I don't like the idea she can book it from here up to there at me. So good at this game. I've literally 100%ed this game. Okay, not 100%ed in the way of doing all of the endings, because for some reason this game has never let me do the VIP ending, and the Afton ending just annoys me. What's that? I've literally completionist ran this game so many times. And you're telling me, after a year, this is the part I can't fucking get past. Because I'm stupid and scared of everything. This area is off limits. I'm a wuss and I admit it daily. Can you just... I'm, I'm actually trying to see if I can find a cycle. Like, look, there... There. There has to be a cycle. This way. Okay. Gonna come back this way or go to the right? Back this way. I don't feel like there's a cycle here. Can you just have a predictable cycle like the staff bots? Please? I swear, if I'm just watching this camera and all it is is this back and forth right here. No, 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 sometimes she does that little turn and then comes right back. I forgot about that part. Why is there a shrimp flavoring packet on my desk? Escape the back- <laughs> Sorry, I feel like I opened Steam instead to just stare at that. Okay. 
Sorry, I got distracted by him saying, This game is just like Security Breach. Escape the back rooms. Looks nice, but also... Listen, here is... Oh, maybe if I just talk about anything and everything. It'll make it easier to do this. Did you finally find a cycle to do? Now that I'm not looking? Oh my god. my name. I hate how fast you are. Can you get out of the door? Fuck! Listen to this stuff and do it. Ordering system. Congratulations. And hang on, I think the, the, the audio is still like a bit too high. Which is weird, because my master volume is like all the way fucking there. You have qualified for a free supreme upgrade. Additional charges may apply. Let's get started. You are now in control of one of our highly qualified pizza making staff bots. Follow the instructions on the left side of your screen to force the bot to make your perfect force the bot. pizza. Yeah, delicious sauce. This don't How need some sauce. How would you rate experience so far? Oh, where have I- well, I've already forgotten where the sauce is. let's get started. Is this one? Would you like to take yes. a short survey about your experience? Don't worry, here's safe with me. Listen, here's uh, my take on life for back rooms. It is now time for some cheese. Yeah. Which is like, eh, but still. Anyways, I'm like, listen. The back rooms were better when it was just ominous, and the fear comes from there could be things here, not there are things here. Now it is time for the not need stuff. It's like, the more you add stuff and you add more NCs, the more it kind of just takes away. Sure, it's cool to add lore to it, but it also takes away. What's scary is there's the thought something could be here, not something is here. I think I'm adding more words to the same point, but still. I feel bad to say that, because I really like seeing the stuff you will come up through the backgrounds, but at the same time... Eh. Ensure a safe and timely delivery. Our cutting edge pizza tracker allows you to deliver the pizza to your own home or residence. Additional mileage charges may apply. save and then go to my least favorite part of this. Actually, the more I'm doing, the more I'm proving it's all my least favorite part. Seriously, why do these just paint it on the wall is what I'm curious about. Why are you painted here? There was a big visual glitch there. What the fuck was that? I want Fred Door back. loading dock, but there's nothing here. There are some big garage doors, but I don't see a way to get out. Do you see a set of controls? Uh, 
I think so. There's a funny locked box with a badge on it. Those are the loading dock controls. Something is not right. Someone must have changed the permissions. You are going to need a much higher security level to get out that way. Come back to me right away. I stand here because... I swear in the past Chica never did this. Maybe I just never tripped it up. I remember so long when she did not notice you were here the entire way. But also, I don't remember her walking this way. But it is a good show of how her thing works. And then I hate this part, because... How the fuck do I understand these cameras? There's two of them for the most convoluted area I've ever seen in my goddamn life. I'm supposed to figure out how to get around that. I guess the two genders, Glamrock Freddy and Glamrock Chica. I think I pointed this out, like, way in the past. Then my question of the day still becomes... In, like, all of the bathrooms, that of course they have it... Being that for, ah, uh, the two genders. It's always, like, Freddy and Chica, or Monty and Chica. And maybe it's because I haven't searched this whole place ground up, but I... I don't remember there being a single bathroom that has Roxy instead. Once again, leading to my final conclusion, non-binary Roxy Cannon. <laughs> Roxy isn't gender enough. <laughs> okay, there's our other conclusion, I guess. I promise I'm not stalling by standing here. Okay, I'm kind of stalling by standing here, but also I have to post a TikTok in like five minutes. And I know if I get sucked into doing this, I'm not going to post it in time. And then the algorithm's gonna hate me and never push my stuff anymore. Yeah, I like doing this thing where I just point at random characters and I go, You are non-binary now. A non-binary ray is from me. I like that all of the lights have a little flicker to them now that I stare at them more. That's really cool. It sucks because flickering lights- Ow, but at the same time. It's a nice touch. Yeah, I'm just stalling at this point. A whole minute passed and I'm still standing here. I can probably think about stuff. <laughs> Yes! Self-indulgent head cannons are like top tier. I'm I'm just pausing so I don't constantly seem like I'm being stupid. I need I'm actually trying to learn more about this backrooms game. But I think they might have the whole entities thing going on. Yep, dangerous entities. There's 15 unique levels based on backrooms lore. Proximity voice chat, nice. Oh my god. Oh my god, Dead by Daylight's only $8 right now. Or you can play for free.
in the next four days. I think that's what I was looking at, but yeah, that could be cool. It would be cool. I want to say the escape the back rooms when I was looking kind of like that. There's the alarm. Looks like a nice indie game. Sounds like it's ten bucks for still early access, but also they had a major update start of this year. I like that I'm looking at other games, but also I know I would not spend my money on any new ones. The only money I have spent lately was today. Oh, that'd be nice, actually. Like that description, I like that, actually. I just imagine indie in the way of just indie developers in general. Got it. Cozy game, but back rooms. Oh god, I hit 6,000 followers on TikTok. You saw me have like a bigger reaction, but I'm just like, oh god. I'm like, the only other thing, like the only thing I spent money on today was, I don't know, I went to do something and the second I got up from my computer, I got an email from Steam like, Hey, just so you know, Guilty Gear Strive, the game you've had in your wish list for like, ever since the start of the year. Yeah, just so you know, that's on sale. And I just bought it immediately. I have like the nice tale of emails where it goes, Guilty Gear Strive is on sale. Thank you for your purchase. Did I have a reasoning to get it? Yes. It just got me $10 off buying both the game and the Bridget DLC, but do I mind? Not really. Okay, it's posted. Let's go. God damn it. You don't see shit. You don't see shit. Turn away! I thought the intimidation route would work, maybe. Like, like it's a thought, you know? <laughs> This TikTok doesn't do well, I'm crying. But also, if the TikTok bot doesn't do its job in the next five minutes, I'm gonna have to do that job. 
It all depends if it's even online. Are you? Yep, fresh talk is online. It's good. Fresh talk, you just gotta do your job. All right, round two. Same shit happens. I'm just gonna play Minecraft instead. Sorry, did they just reuse the same fucking animation at this point? I found the loading the dock. Crash? There's nothing here. There what are have I doing? The oh, doors, that. but I don't see a way to get out. Do you see a set of controls? I think so. There's a funny lock box with a badge on it. Those are the loading dock. Thank you for believing me. The last time we just kind of stood here for a minute. I run in. And where is she? Right there. Thank you, Come Fresh Talk. Right you did away. your job. I forgot Fresh Talk actually does the job in like three minutes. Okay, round two. Figure out how the fuck to read these camera. Hello? Okay, yep, I knew it was a lock in the locker room. I hate this thing. I can't see anywhere in here that's like actually useful to me, but I sure can see multiple angles of the same goddamn laundry room. And I sure can't see where Chica is in the fucking locker room. And then watch me like walk full full faith into here and there she is. God damn it. God damn it. Oh no, I hope you feel better soon. Is she? Where the fuck am I? Damn it! Apparently I'm facing this- am I down here? No, not down here. But I'm apparently facing this way. From which direction am I facing this way? Where is she? You know what, I'll just- I'll just give us a more fitting fucking uh, expression! Where the fuck is she? Where am I in relation to this? Where are you going? <gasps> Not in that one. I'm not in either of those. Where am I? Where is she? Did my humidifier just fucking run out of water? Where are you? Fuck! I give up. I'm looking at stuff on my own real quick. Stab only. This is the thing I'm talking about right here. Mm -hmm. I've told you guys this before. Absolute perfection. perfection. No ifs, ands, or buts. This fight here is absolute perfection. Looking for you. 
walking away from me, or... I'm chancing. I just- I shouldn't have chanced it! I'm chancing it. I shouldn't have chanced it! <laughs> it's still going! Why is it still- Thank you, God. Okay, do we chance it again? Finally, I know where this one is on the fucking cameras. I'm over there. Spring Bean is in a constant state of misery, I guess. I like how these cameras don't help one fucking bit! None of them are in, like, a helpful area at all. I am so tempted to just book it out of here now. Wait, I'm so is that a fucking- Have there been fucking sound distractions here this whole time? And I didn't know? So, um, that's my Yankee. Okay. Are you telling me there's been sound distractions the whole time and I didn't fucking know? Right there. Right the fuck there. Dumbass. Okay. Alright, fellas. Let's... Let's chance it again. Let's not chance it again. This this scares me actually. I don't see her anywhere. This doesn't help at all. This doesn't help at all. Staff only. I just went out of here. I believe in you. Thank you, String Bean. My friendly security staff can help. Okay. Okay. You know what? You know what? You know, as 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 an idiot with nothing but spite and ADHD flowing through my veins. I work like a shark. Constantly moving. God damn it. Now I'm in that one. I don't see her anywhere. I work like a shark. Constantly moving or I'll fucking die. Holy shit, I did it. Nowhere you need to know. My least favorite part of all of this, she sounds so close by all the time. No, my, oh wait, and hang on, I need to see if this still happens. There's a, this one with the flashlight. And he'll still get tripped up even if you're in here. He doesn't anymore, thank fuck. 
Anyways. I am no longer... Mm, I should still be in a state of fear because I still have to book it out this way. But also, you can usually just run that way and make it. Never mind, he's turning around. Sure, we got, like, the hardest visual part out of, out of it. We didn't get the rest, though. Which is, now you got these slow as fuck mop bots going around. I think we'll find a gap. Alright guys, welcome to White Woman Jump Scare. Take a map. Take a map. Take a map. Out of my way! Why would I need to skip that? That's like by the time that it would load me holding it long enough to skip that, it would Where am I? Look at all this. Be over. This stuff. one I I would skip Freddy? and it would be done by Freddy, the time I'm done there? skipping. Open the door and there's Vanny. Ah, uh, never mind. No, 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 no. There is a safe area, I remember. So you run around this way. Don't get caught by either staff bots. There's the charging station here. Comes in handy later. And there's a save station here. So I don't have to do the quick process of running away from Vanny again. You see, I'm tempted because I could hop over the Phaser Blast, but there's no way to get out of Phaser Blast without messing with game data. Because they patched out, basically they patched out the Phaser Blast early skip the second that they also patched out being able to do Fred Door. Because how you would do Phaser Blast early skip is by using Freddy to push you back through the elevator. But, uh, that Freddy, doesn't happen anymore. are you okay? There you are. I'm when I tried to so do it, I got worried. stuck there because I saved over it, I so I had to use the uh, schism launcher. I missed the hour of the each of Give myself a party pass I didn't have to actually get out of there. I think something is wrong. Is there anything I can do? Help me, 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 me get to parts and surface. Of course I will. How do we get there? It is down under the main stage. Normally the stage lift takes me down there after every concert. That is really the only way I know how. Use that door behind me, me, me. It will take you to the rehearsal room on the other side of the building. Look uh, for a sorry, backstage he have pass, been... then find a way to turn on the lift. Good luck, Superstar. Entering rest mode. Okay. I'll do my best. 
Because you see, what I also like to do is maybe not get the vanny ending by that point. But like, my favorite thing to do was like, around 1am, instead of going either way, you use Fred door to get through here and get past all the invisible walls they used to have. Uh, climb up there, jump over to Phaser Blast, play Phaser Blast, get the blaster, take it with you, and just shoot anybody that gets in your fucking way during this part. Best sequence breaking. What power is it at? Oh, okay, it's not that fucking bad, but also, for me, constantly just flicking this thing on and off for whatever I want, sure does fuck up. I love how heavily warped it looks from the sides. Bet me. Yep, that's Freddy, alright. Guys, right, that's him. Are you lost? Are we referring to style theory? Because I, I, I hate to say, my main bit is I could care less for Matt Pat half the fucking time. I have seen half of the game theory merch, and you're telling me this man gets to talk about style. Sneak away, little coward. Huh? I'm booking it, I'm booking it, I'm booking it, call it in a day. Ooh, look, this makes noise! You, Ooh, look, you didn't see me get in here! You don't know I'm in here, actually. No, you don't- GOD DAMN IT! That was too long of a fucking time period to react to that, though. That was too long of a time period to react to that, though! Fair. That was so late of a fucking reaction to finally get to the locker and swing the door open and rip me out of it. <laughs> what a gamer. What a god of a gamer, seriously. My, you know what, here's, here's the rule. If I die, like, the same way, uh, twice in a row trying to avoid it, I'm just giving up and playing Minecraft. I don't have to endure this again. I love this game. I do. Well, I'm getting sick. I'm so tired of being shit at this game again. You know, I opened Twitter to, like, de-stress for a second before I run into that again. And the first thing I fucking saw was Jerma. But also, this is what I get for following multiple, like, Jerma out of context accounts.
Why are there mul- I'm- I'm sorry, I'm looking at the fucking Germa Twitch chat out of context account now. These- this is what Twitter was made for, goddammit. And I like that I see twice in a row people submitting something that is different people yelling at Germa. Stop moaning, Germa. Please, Germa, stop moaning. What the fuck is this man doing? I'm just reading these off so we can all share this experience while I sit here hating this experience. <laughs> Not this one, the other one, you know, the actual game that I'm supposed to be playing. <clears throat> I remember I had a dream about Jerma where he was a guest at my house and would sit on my expensive white couch and eat peanut oil with his hands and rubbed it off on all my furniture. I got angry at him and he just said it was like that when he got there. He kept- he ruined my entire house with peanut oil by rubbing it all over my furniture and just made weird eating noises and telling me my house was really messy. <sighs> Thank you, Frank, for the input. I had made Jerma in The Sims to see how long he could survive on his own, and I kept having nightmares about stuff that Sims Germo would do. Stop liking this, I promise I'm not a freak! Germo ruined my life. <laughs> I think some people shouldn't have internet access. Oh my god, dot 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 dot. Has Jerma twerked yet? Dot 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 dot. Oh my god, I forgot my favorite one. I've had this saved in my gallery for a while, too. Wow! Never made a stream! Not coming back, either! I hate you! Germa, I've returned once again to ask you about your opinion regarding tectonic plates. Any thoughts? Actually, what the fuck are Germa's comments on his own chat? Uh, sad people hits me so hard. That emote really hits me. When I see it, it just- I just eternally want to help. Buddy.
He looks like one of those weirdos from the Storage Wars shows that pawn off the storage boxes. Jerma's got an anime girl's jaw. I think Jerma would really thrive as a medieval peasant, like not even as a jester. I mean Jerma as some surf field worker would be having a great time getting strong of farm work then just hanging out slinging jokes making the whole tavern chortle enjoying the natural beauty of the world. Like tell me I'm wrong. You look like the dad from Twilight. Make more hammers. Stop making hammers! Hammer time. I like when Chad- I- okay, this isn't funny anymore. Okay, let's go. The bit's done. Never heard of it. Are you lost? Bad word fucking struggle. Now remember, everybody, the rules are simple. Lived our entire life with undiagnosed ADHD. I work like a shark. If I stop moving, I die. Go! You can't hide forever. Yes, I can. Fuck you. <laughs> Is this the same mistake twice? <laughs> Are you lost? Damn it! <laughs> the shark approach didn't work! The shark approach didn't work! Damn it! <sighs> okay. Okay. Oh yeah, I forgot Freddy's dead. Are you lost? I wish you'd stop turning around. Halfway through your s where you're supposed to be walking. I, bet I, I just don't like that in this area... Suddenly, the game goes into a loading screen for a second. That means this that butt should not see me here. I'll look around for where she's pacing and figure it out. Okay. Don't be scared. In order to sneak behind her, she will see. You are nothing. WHY DO YOU TURN AROUND?! <laughs> okay, I'm done. You guys want some fucking Minecraft? I've like never even- <laughs> Fuck this game. Actually. Why does the Minecraft launcher already need an update? <sighs> we could play Punch Out Onyx. <laughs> We're doing so many other things that are not security breach. I hate this game now. I swear, that's the one part I used to never struggle getting past. And now I am.
Okay. I've decided my goal with Minecraft is I'm not doing anything like a hardcore world or something. I'm gonna do what I've said about Minecraft before, which is if I play Minecraft on stream, it's most likely just gonna be to explore that one, like, Disneyland server. That's just like a good recreation of Disney parks. I'm being tempted to play Delta Room soon. <laughs> okay, so Minecraft, I. This is why I want to plan the games I play before stream. Because when I don't, then we run into issues like this. Where Minecraft's a fucking fault. Okay, here's a stupid thing I've apparently learned. I swear to god. Okay, so uh, Bedrock launches just fine. Yeah, fucking Bedrock launches just fine. I can play on bedrock. Just fine. But I tried to play Java, and I downloaded it the way that I had to, which was through the Microsoft Store, because it moved over to the Microsoft Store. And it said if I tried to download it from the Minecraft website that I needed to pay for it again, and I, I don't have Minecraft money, okay? I don't have money to buy Minecraft twice. I paid for Minecraft before. But in the launcher, it says I'm missing files for the Java one. Don't know how that happened. But it just launched Bedrock like it was nothing. God, if it connects to the server on this, I'm going to scream. Nope, it can't connect to that one.
distracted by emotes. stop investigating this because I'm going to keep doing that and that's for my own time. Anyways, I need to... F this is probably for also my own time to figure out why Java won't launch. Because you know they made you integrate everything to from like your Java account. Not your, your Java. Your Mojang account to a Microsoft account. For some fucking reason. It's just breaking Java. It's downloading everything, but it doesn't download everything and stops itself. Which is weird. So, I think Minecraft is a lost cause until I can mess with that. Oh hey, it still remembers my skin. So that's something for me to figure out in my own time. I might actually call it a wrap here because I do have some stuff I need to do. Like, okay, I pushed back stream because I had stuff to do, which was partially hang out with Hunter because I haven't been able to this week when I stream earlier, and partially because I needed to get a hold on some stuff that I needed to actually do. Which, honestly, all it broke down to was uh, taking care of my dogs again, ordering a pizza and picking it up, and... Shut up. And getting a shower in. Self care good. However, from there, I need music. However, from there, uh, I still need to do stuff like laundry. Like, I definitely need to do laundry. Just in the way of. <laughs> yeah. So I need to get that done. I need to run the dogs out a last time. So I hate to say I'm gonna wrap up here, but this is around the time we usually do, even on my normal stream days. I can send you guys elsewhere though. That'll be fun. Cause I know Bug went live. And I think Miss Jackie's been live for a minute, so we have two options. I think I'll send over to Bug, because my channel's been already suggesting Miss Jackie. Bug it is. Have fun with fucking Wario! Because I know that's what's happened. Uh, that's that's all I got. I hate to say, uh, I'm gonna figure out Minecraft, so we might stream Minecraft tomorrow, or it could be Poshionomics tomorrow. It's a 50/50, but it's not like this is the only week we can do this stuff. But that's that's my options. We're definitely getting back into Red Dead on like Friday. That's the only bit I can't say. But uh, yeah. 
I don't have a rough schedule, but I do want to play Minecraft this week because you guys did vote for that. So I will be dedicated to trying to figure out what's up and actually make it play the Java version that I want to play. So, that's that. Have a good rest of your day, night, whatever it is for you. I'll see you in the next stream. Go say hi to Bug. Have fun. I'll see you then with hopefully Minecraft. Oh, goodbye!